something wrong? Uh, nothing I can't fix. I gotta get this thing moving again. these things. Oh, geez. Just kill it. No, it'll sting me. Elizabeth. I have a better idea. Wait, 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 what are you doing? Opening tear. Oh, shit. What is that? It's a tear. I used to open them all the time in my tower. What is a tear? It's like a, a, a window. A window to another world. Most of the time their doll is dishwater, a different colored towel or tea instead of coffee. But sometimes, sometimes I see something amazing, and I pull it through. There. Good God. I don't suppose you've got an airship in there? I don't think so. But there is... There... There is something. I... Oh, oh no! Close it. I, I'm trying! Close it! <laughs> I don't really understand what I just saw back there. But it sure as hell looks like a shortcut to getting us killed. But I could help. I can handle whatever comes along. Trust me. Have it your way, I suppose. To the sky, Comstock bent his knee. <laughs> can you help me out with this lock? <sighs> Child's play. There.
Much obliged. Second thought. I think those tears of yours might come in handy next time we're in a scrape. Well, there has to be a tear around here. I think that keen eye of yours can find some ammunition lying around. I sure could use it when there's trouble. I'll take some scrounging, but I'll do my best. Clear. We can take the skyline to the Hall of Heroes. Look for supplies in that bar back down the street. know the fella. Seems he's still got a knack for making enemies. Great! Yeah. 
Comstock, commander of the 7th Cavalry. That man did not lead the 7th. Hell, I don't even remember the guy. Corporal DeWitt proved his worth on the field that day. Well, I'll be. Slate? Is that you? You've always been different, haven't you, Booker? You crave no glory. Look, I see you're caught up in some kind of jam here. If you could see fit to let us through to where they keep the shock jockey, and we'll that tin soldier, Comstock, wants my boys dead. We won't die at his hands. There's going to be trouble. All my men have left is a choice. Die at the hands of a tin soldier, or a real one! <laughs> Give us the shock jockey. If you want the vigor, Booker, you will give my men a soldier's death. They wait for you in me and Peggy. Feel better already. I'll try to keep you stocked with both bandages and ammo, but the right materials are close at hand. The tin soldier is taking credit for the deeds of the real ones. Now your companion, young lady, he wrapped himself in glory on December 29, 1890. What does he mean? And cry with hatchet red, they danced amongst our noble dead. But when our soldiers took the field, the savage horde could only yield. <laughs> <laughs> 